Why, why are preachers shouting and why are they always proclaiming and, and always act as if you know, it's, it's, it's life and death? And they say, well, maybe it's an act. Uh, maybe it is for some, but I'll speak for myself. Here's why preachers speak the way they do. It's because they've realized that they stood before the holy tribunal of God condemned a man for hell. And then God in His mercy said, come drink, come eat at His table freely and without price, and I'll adopt you as my son. That will make someone proclaim this message. That will make someone actually say amazing grace. Think about this. The eternal God hung bloody on a cross and His hands that made creation were pressed with nails for me. And so God's law demands my blood. The one who sins against this this law shall die. That's what the Bible says. And instead, the God who wrote that law spills His blood for me. And then He passed a cup in my direction and said, take and drink, this is the blood of the new covenant. As many as drink of it shall live. You can't believe this and stay the same. You can't believe this and then hate your neighbor. You can't believe this and then have no regard for God. Because when you believe this, you see that the Holy One stood in my law place condemned so that I could go free and have true everlasting joy. That's what the law is. And that's what the gospel is. What God requires, He gives us in Jesus Christ. 